Hi. Um, so I know that you're a co-lead on the b 2 b to x project. I just wondered if you could tell us more about that project and what business problems it's trying to solve. b 2 b to x uh, project uh, uh, want to solve problem about b 2 b to x obviously, and uh, to provide the best practice to uh, develop a new business model and uh, business model involving partners. And so, for the time being, when uh, you want to, to onboard partner, to work with partner, you do it in an ad hoc manner. Mm -hmm. And the goal of B2B2X project is to propose best practice, to propose pattern, to, to propose templates to help TM4 member and uh, other digital industry players to set up partnership very much more quickly, much more easily, and in, um, I would say, uh, industrial way. Mm -hmm. So, uh, for that, we uh, have a different kind of action. We already define a partnering guide, so uh, in each release of the framework, we uh, Im try to improve, to add additional features in this partnering guide, and also, since uh, version uh, 15 of the framework, we began to describe business scenario. The goal of business scenario is to describe, based on a template, real B2B2X business scenario in order to have a set of examples, and based on this set of examples, to find commonalities, to define patterns, to improve our, our uh, partnering guide and also to give food, food for another uh, work stream, the digital service toolkit, mm -hmm. in order to allow it, it to um, provide, I would say, uh, components from the framework allowing to support this different, uh, the, this different business scenario. Mm -hmm. Okay, and I know that you're also the co-lead on the APIs project. What kind of work are you doing there? What kind of problems are you trying to solve with members? Uh, regarding the uh, API project, uh, we are working this week uh, on two different uh, ways. The first way will be to continue the uh, specification. I would not uh, say exactly the specification, but defining or finalizing a requirement for several APIs or set of APIs, where this week uh, mostly focused on uh, the onboarding APIs and, uh, or a set of APIs that would help us to onboard partner, also on pre-ordering APIs going to uh, prepare an order before uh, sending the uh, uh, final order, uh, on some more I would say operating services of OSS oriented APIs, change management, test management, etc. So it is the first, uh, our first focus. Continue the uh, definition of requirement, and after that, having after the um, uh, the uh, team action week, uh, some spec jam session in order to finalize the specification of APIs. And the second uh, part is working on reference document. Uh, for example, working on the conformance guideline, how to deci decide that one API is conform with uh, um, uh, TM4M rules, with TM4M specification, working also on uh, the uh, TM4M and NFV uh, APIs. I mean, what are the needs of network function virtualization program regarding APIs, defining also the architecture that will be uh, the best one for um, for uh, um, smart cities, how to use the uh, TM from APIs on, in a smart city context and uh, some uh, other uh, reference document like this one. And are you looking for more people to join the APIs group? Who would you recommend it would be beneficial for to come and join the team? Yes, uh, we are looking on uh, B2B2X and APIs also yeah. for other contributors because it's uh, always interesting to have more contributors to be able to define 
standards, to define common standards, to share ideas, because as we, uh, as we say, together we can do more. And we are more clever with 10 people than only with one people. So the more we are, the more clever we uh, are, the more things you can, uh, we can sh uh, share and uh, the best work we can do. Mm -hmm. And what value do you get from coming to Action Week to move these projects ahead? The value coming from Action Week is to have the most important value is to have face-to-face -face meeting yeah. because during the year we have calls. Calls, it's fine, but having sometimes uh, having sometimes face-to-face uh, -face meeting, sometimes you discuss during one month with a phone call you don't understand. Mm -hmm. People are like me not all native English speaker, mm -hmm. so there is a cultural or language difference. Yeah. So with a paper board, with discussion and face to face, it's much more easy and we can solve in one hour a problem that we have since one month. Great, thank you very much for your Thank you.